St. John, come in. This is Corporal St. John. Uh, what's up, Captain? I need you to head back to command. Stat. Meet me at the infirmary. The infirmary? What's wrong? Hey, you're not supposed to be. Been... <sighs> come in. Sarah? Oh, God damn it. Hey, Corporal. Hey, man. Oh, hey, no, I, I didn't mean nothing. Just Corporal. See you, man. What's going on? Captain? Dr. Jimenez has been murdered. What? You're the son of a bitch. Jesus Christ. Slit his throat from here to Where's here. Where's Taylor? Did, did Taylor see anything? All the narcotics in the camp are gone. Taylor. This one's on me. I assigned him to the infirmary. No, no, that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying Taylor was a junkie. You knew? It doesn't matter. This day, as the sun sets on this island, it also sets on the life of a great man, Captain Arturo Jimenez. Doc, to many of you, is gone. Taken from us on the eve of our great victory. Captain Jimenez was murdered, slaughtered, his life ripped from him. His blood, even now, soaks the tent where he toiled, hour after hour, tending our sick, our injured, our wounded. The great tragedy here is not that a good man needlessly lost his life, though for that I am indeed very sorry. The great tragedy here is that he could not be replaced. Dr. Jimenez was the only trained physician in our ranks, perhaps in all the world. My eyes have been opened. I see now the great mistake we have made. We have filled our ark with books and seeds and discs. Medical journals, medical books and encyclopedia we have in spades. But who now, when this terrible war is over, will teach us how to use them? Journals can be replaced. Books and encyclopedia can be replaced. Dr. Jimenez, our only doctor. Come in. Corporal St. John and Captain Curry. This is Curry. Hey, uh, I'm gonna go after Taylor. Several patrols have already been sent out. Comes furious. Yeah, I'll bet. That was a good guy. Captain. 
captain in Mechas. He's the only doctor we have. Look, Taylor mentioned something about heading up to the ski lodge. I'm gonna go there and see if I can. Radio me if you do. Incorporate. The colonel wants Taylor alive. Right. Copy that. Say John out. What's at the gate? It's one of Curry's men. Open it up. Corporal. Deacon. Good. Thank you for reporting in so quickly. It sounded urgent, sir. It is. We have another hostage situation. Hostage? Damn, it seems like every squatter within a dozen miles has it in for us. Or for the militia. You know, I mean... It does seem that way. I've marked his last known position on your map. He's just a kid, St. John. Private Ross. Ethan. I sent him to track down a group of marauders, and he must have gotten in over his head. Private Ross. I don't know him, but, uh, I'll get him out alive, Captain. Good luck, St. John. Dismissed. Make your bullshit spoil it for me.
Okay. Bounty. Yeah, let's see. That should do it. Jesus, how little camp they got going on here. Four of us to hold him down. You see that? He still wouldn't tell us nothing. He's still dead. He should have just gone quiet. <laughs> We're in business. Coming. Come on! Now that! That was a lot of goddamn motors. Oh, Jesus. Hey, Ethan. I presume, uh, yeah? How are you doing, Corporal? Buddy? Man, am I glad to see you. Yeah? 
You didn't want to join up with those assholes? Hell no. And I had no idea what they were going to do to me. Yeah, well, it wasn't going to be good. Uh, are you good to get out of here on your own? Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, man. Yeah, not bad. 